Hi everyone, I'm Kareem Martin from The Courier Press. I was asked to put together a video to share a personal story with everyone tonight about why the Eagles Heart and Cancer Telethon has an extra special meaning to me and my family this year. My brother's name is Nick Morgan. He and I grew up in the Bagley area, went to River Ridge to school, and have basically lived in the Prairie du Chien area most of our lives. About five years ago or so, he moved to Madison and he works at Meritor Hospital there. He was diagnosed with diabetes at the age of 13 and about the time that he moved to Madison, things started progressing downward and his diabetes was not looking so good. Um, his medical team advised him that he should look into becoming a candidate for a simultaneous pancreas and kidney transplant, which is a double organ transplant um, that are, are placed at the same time from a deceased patient. And this would allow Nick to basically not have diabetes at all anymore, which is amazing to think of. Anyway, um, we decided that that was the route that he was going to take was to pursue this transplant. And in preparing for that, he had to take a series of tests to ensure that his body would be capable of having surgery, such a major surgery. During the testing process, his doctors found that he actually had about three blockages in his heart and that he needed to undergo triple bypass surgery right away to have those repaired. And so in February of 2020, he underwent that surgery. Um, it was a very scary time for all of us. And um, the saving grace for us was that he was in the best place possible for this type of surgery and that they do these kinds of surgeries all the time. They're, you know, they know them very well and Nick was, was a pretty straightforward case. So he went in for surgery. Everything actually went well. His doctor was Dr. Amy Fiedler and she was phenomenal. She's one of the best in the nation there at UW in Madison. And um, everything went great. He was with, out of the hospital within about a week in recovery and started to heal and prepare to be placed on the list for the simultaneous pancreas and kidney transplant. And because of all of that, he in fact received his transplant in October of 2020 both the pancreas and the kidney and he no longer has diabetes which is a complete miracle um we're forever grateful to his donor but we're also so entirely thankful for the opportunities that he has been allowed the money that you are donating and the money that you have donated is making a huge difference in the lives of people like my brother in the lives of our neighbors, our families, and our friends. What this Eagles Heart and Cancer Telethon has done over the years is unbelievable. And we can keep it up. This year, things might look a little bit different, but at the end of the day, we still have the same goal, and that's to fundraise for heart disease and cancer research and use our little town efforts to make a difference. We should all be very proud of that. I hope that by sharing my brother's story, I've compelled at least one of you to make a donation. Thanks again. Have a good night.